What's up guys, Tony here with iTech Check, and today we're going to be taking a look at some more cases for the iPhone 11 Pro Max. Now these cases I got off Amazon, they're just ones that I thought looked pretty cool and I wanted to share them with you. Uh, I will be putting a link in the description in case you guys want to check them out yourself. And if you guys like me and you want to support my channel, please use that link because it helps me keep buying products for you guys to do reviews. So here are the cases. These are seal by Cyril cases. The cool thing about these that I saw were the little buttons that are on here are removable and they come with a couple different colors like uh, this case is green with orange buttons but they also come with black ones so you can swap these out which is pretty cool so I mean unfortunately you have to buy another case to you know get the colors but I'd kind of like to put maybe the, the orange on the black case um, to see how cool that looked but let's go ahead and take a look at these cases so it has like a kind of like a rigid rubbery uh, bumper on the side here and then it's got that frosted hardcover back but it kind of it all kind of feels like the back of the iPhone that kind of matte glass which is uh, really nice and it's kind of you know that got that rubber it's a smooth rubber it's not a grippy rubber on the side so let's go ahead and put it in the phone and see how it looks definitely holds the phone in really well um, it feels solid uh, in the hands the buttons they're super responsive very easy to click so let's see about that lip it's got some raised edge, not a super big raised edge, but if you put it down on something flat, you won't have to worry about it touching your screen. But now if you do put a screen protector, it would probably come just up to the edge, so then you might have to worry. Uh, it's got seal by Cyril written on the side there. There's your volume rocker, and then the little thing for your vibration button. There the cutouts for the mics and the charging port. There's the back, like I said. It's got kind of like that frosted backing. It feels kind of smooth and rubbery. That's pretty cool. That looks nice. Like I said, the buttons don't protrude out very much, but they're, they're responsive. Very easy to click. Okay, so that's that one. I said this, the black one comes with the gray uh, buttons and it also comes with black buttons as well. In case you want to swap those out and like I said unfortunately you have to buy another case to get a different color of the buttons so here's the green one on my space gray kind of reminds me of like a halo Xbox <laughs> that's pretty nice I do I kind of like the orange kind of want to put that on the black case well, that's the green the back you can barely see the Apple logo through there the, you know the back actually has a kind of raised edge too so you don't have to worry about your phone uh, camera lumps there hitting anything so that's pretty cool it's a little recessed and this is how it comes to you in like this Ziploc bag So this is the clear case, and again, comes with black buttons. The clear has gray buttons, which looks pretty neat. This would actually probably look kind of cool with the orange too. I kind of like the clear too, I'm kind of partial to that. I like, I like the, how it's frosted, it feels nice and like it's smooth, you know? Oh, that look kind of cool with the, the green too. Oh, that's the frosted clear case with the gray buttons. It's pretty nice too. So let's swap out some buttons and see what they look like. It's super easy to pop them out. Let's see how easy it is to get them back in. Okay, so I want to take out these orange ones. So that, that came out really easy. Okay, so they just pop out, super simple. Let's see how easy it is to get them back in. Okay, so let's start with the power button. 
So it's got these lines on it. So you probably want those to go on the inside here. And there it is, it's in. That was easy. So let's put in these. These don't look to have any lines on it, but the it looks to have a, like a thinner side. You probably wanna put that one in. So the buttons were super, super simple to push uh, in from the inside rather than the outside like I did on the other one. So let's put the phone in here now. <laughs> That's cool, black on orange. I really like that one. That is cool. What do you guys think? What's your favorite color combination? I'm really, I really kind of like that uh, black with the orange. It really stands out. Makes it easy to see the buttons. So that's pretty much it for the seal case by Shrill. Um, let me know what you guys think in the comments. What do you think about this case? I think it's a pretty cool find. Like I said, I was just searching on Amazon. Oh, wait a minute. Spigen. This is made by Spigen. Interesting. I didn't know that. I, it didn't say anything on Amazon. I was just kind of searching for cases, but it says it right there. Spigen, okay, well, very cool cases. So again, if you guys wanna check these out yourself, I will be putting a link in the description below. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that little notification bell to let you guys know when I put out new videos. And if you guys haven't already checked it out, make sure you check out my unboxing video of my iPhone 11 Pro Max because in that video, you will have a chance to win an iPhone 11. Just make sure you click on the link, watch the video and follow the directions and you're good to go. I will be putting out some more um, accessories for the iPhone uh, 11 Pro and the 11 Pro Max. So again, I can't stress that enough. If you guys haven't subscribed, make sure you do. So I hope you have a good day. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Later.